Hey guys, Road Rage Fusion here from Road Rage Studios, bringing you episode 26 of Road Rage Racetracks. This episode, Aurora Oceanis by SMM 2010 2010. Um, so, this is a very, very smooth double wide. It's got some nice aesthetics. Um, yeah. And it's built very close to the water, which I think looks quite nice. So it's got some aesthetics on the side here, as you can see, buildings. I'm not entirely sure what they're meant to represent, but uh, yeah. Uh, I like the rock formations here, and it gives you a sense of being very enclosed. And to the left there, I'm not sure what the aesthetic piece there was. It, was, it looked a bit like a small campsite. Um, I, I'm not entirely sure. So, as I said, it's a very, very smooth track, um, it, there's not really any bumps, there's not any tapering, um, yeah, so that it, it's one of my favourite double wides, I've raced on it quite a lot. <laughs> um, I also like how he's put the, um, the yellow light around the rocks there, it gives them a, a, light, a, a texture of being damp. And here, the main part of this map that caught my eye was that big lift. It slows you down with the two shield doors jutting out the floor, and there are shield doors at the landing of the jump. Um, but yeah, otherwise, there are very few jumps, the big jumps, that don't have shield doors. There are some, just not that many. Yeah, so. Um, you missed the aesthetic, pe aesthetic piece that we've just passed there. You don't see that. I like how um, he's put the barriers on some parts of the map, barriers around the sides of the track. I don't. I do think it look. It looks quite nice. Uh, he's uh, he's put um, pieces that look like they're supporting the track. So that's becoming more and more common these days. But uh. Yeah, this it still looks nice. Um, I think here uh, I tried to be cocky on the next two laps and drive right on the side, <laughs> and then I realised I have to turn. Um, yeah, I, th yeah, I mess up a bit on this landing, but like a pro, I drive off. So he has the two starting areas on the left and right there, which. Um, you don't see in tons of maps, in a lot of maps, you just start, you just drive, str oh my god, you just start driving on the track, but I like it on tracks where you actually have a designated spot. And there's actually, I don't know if you saw it, just back there, there's again a another aesthetic piece, I think, it's just a health pack on the, um, on one of the rocks, I don't know what it's there for, but. Yeah, so, um, to recap this map, it's a very, very, very smooth track. I cannot emphasize that enough. Um, it's got really nice aesthetics, not all of them having a theme, just things to look at while you're racing. Um, yeah, so I don't have tons more to say about this map. Um, really, go download this track, SMM. 2010 is a very very good forger. I've raced some of his maps before and I think I've showcased one before this uh, with music which I also want to say guys we're now going to be doing commentaries instead of music. Okay so now for two videos you may have missed. Um, the last video was District 7 by Trebidor and two videos ago was the Grand Prix series by Exobase. Thanks for watching guys and we'll see you next time.